What's up everybody, back with some more robots. So today we're taking a look at the kid with Cinder and Sar. So I decided to run this build today because I want to run the kid pretty much with triple stove ability with the two Cinders plus the actual stove ability that the kid has. And yeah, so we got the uh, Titan armor kit two times and the Onslaught reactor once. And I got the Sar with the Cinder. And yeah, we're just going to jump right in. Oh my goodness. I had a feeling I was going to get this map. Well, we want to get the Titan, so... It's a good thing I put the Siren in. I got the Siren with Gecko and Prisma. Thought I'd run this. Because the goal is to get the siren, or the kid, not the siren. Holy! That damage was all from me. Jeez, I don't know what that was, but that thing got whooped. I honestly think that was a specter. I, th I do think that was a specter. Well, I mean, I guess this is one way to get the Titan. Oh my goodness, my health. Wow, those Venoms do a lot of damage. Well, this Fender is gonna push, but he's almost... No, that's a Fender. Oh, that's a Harpy. Okay. I gotta get my ability. I'm gonna help out with center a little bit. Maybe I can kill this Orochi. Come on, target switch. There we go. I should have this Orochi. Okay, that was probably not a smart idea to do what I just did, but uh, our Titan's almost ready, so that's the good thing. Uh -oh. Trying to kill this Orochi, got him. Double kill, but I'm gonna go down. That was fine, that was a pretty decent run. What is going on over here? Got the Fenrir with the new, or kind of new, uh, Bendies, if you will. Gonna put a heal down. This, this build really isn't ideal for close range battles like this, but, I mean, it still works. Our Titan is ready, so if I can maybe drop it here, that'd be kind of nice. Kind of wait for the enemy to come to me. Now there's an Orion on me. That's fine. Okay, we died. Okay, I'm gonna drop the kid. This is what I mean. Triple snow. Alright, I might take some big damage, good thing I do have the, oh my gosh I'm getting hit by another one, okay I'm frozen, I took more than half of my health, oh yes, we've got a Demeter, perfect, um, I'm in a bad spot, this is a terrible map for this world. Yeah, I'm not really going to get a good game out of this one. No, not really. Alright, we're going to spawn the Kefri. Put toxins on it. Thought I'd try this. But against this guy, I'm going to go down super fast.
Maybe we can get a better map. I mean, we did help out with that vendor, so that's a good thing. But that's probably all we were able to do. Plus, you gotta remember this is a kid titan. So, definitely not the strongest. This build is doing a lot of damage to that meter. I get range, I'm in range. But I don't think that's gonna do much. Nope. Alright, so we're gonna lose this game for sure. I'm now in the Yao Jun. What? How did he have time to face shift me in my ability? Like, well, I was already in my stealth. How does that make sense? Alright, so that's the first game. That kid really didn't do that well just because of the long range and because it's a kid. But first place, 1.5 million damage, 2 kills, 1 beacon. I mean, for a kid, I guess that was okay. But hopefully we can get a better map. I was thinking like moon map, that would be really good because of the cover. I can just stay behind the cover and like hit people with the cinders. And in that last game on Springfield that we just literally just played, um, I was also getting hit by two Orions. Surprisingly, I did survive them kind of well, but I was hitting like getting hit by the Fenrir, the two Orions, the Shuranga, the Siren, and I think even a Harpy. So there's like too many things shooting me. Okay, so now we are on Rome map. This map is okay. There's not really that many spots for me to like kind of sit behind. But we're going to start with this. This is my first time running this build on the Pepper. That's a Spectre. If I can link to this guy, I'm going after that Spectre. Yeah. Uh, never mind, he's dead. Okay, I guess I can help out with my teammate. Oh boy. I'm still hitting this guy. I don't know if he realizes. Alright, I'm gonna need my ability without a teammate. I've got two Puncher Orochis. Uh, I'm not sure if that Croce is gonna kill him. That, that did. Perfect. Oh, jeez. That guy got Viper. I'm gonna need my ability. Okay, I'm gonna heal in the process. And I'm gonna link to this Mercury. My gosh. That Mercury's going so fast. Okay, I can do a little bit of damage before I die. That's fine. I'm gonna drop the Fenrir now. Good thing with these weapons, I can do this. He's not safe no matter where he goes. Alright, that guy got taken out. Whoa. There's another Fenrir in the center. Gonna put the mantis down. Oh, my goodness. Okay, got him. My Titan's ready. I'm not sure I want to drop it just yet, though. Oh, jeez. I'm not going that way. <laughs> no, thank you. That's a leech. He's leeching. Don't want to fire at him. I still don't know why players, after all these years, still fire at leeches. It's been, like, what? Two, three years since the leech came out? Maybe four? This guy is gonna be. Yep, there we go. Okay. Maybe they might be getting center. What is that, a hawk? Alright, I got killed. I guess we can try this. I mean, we are gonna fight a leech, so. Shouldn't have too much problems. He's gonna go down super fast. Kill. Okay, if I can, I'm gonna get behind the call and see him. 
If that's what that's called, I think it is. I don't know why this guy wants to come straight. Or, okay, he's reaching. Sorry, I had him just for a split second so I can get the Nexus. Stove abilities on. I'm gonna allow him to get that beacon. Just so this game drags on a little bit longer. Oh no. Putting the resistance up. I don't know if that's gonna do a lot of damage. Or, I don't know if that's gonna help. Uh, that's a hawk. That's an Arthur. Man, whoa, 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 okay, no, 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 no. I didn't see the loot door. Oh, I'm done. Alright. Well, I guess we did okay. Ooh. This, this build again. What the heck? This build against this Arthur is going to do so much damage. Uh oh. Oh, no. Actually, I didn't really take that much damage. I thought I'd take a lot more damage than what I took. Yeah, this guy was dead anyways. Okay, once I get my ability, I'm thinking I'm gonna kill this out June. Or, not the out June, but Arthur. Buddy, already died. Okay, what's that? Oh, that's the elite floor. I had to reload. That was kind of a waste of the flight right there. That's another Arthur. So that kid, it did do pretty well, I guess. I mean, yeah, we took out the Leech, and then in the first game, we took out the Fenrir. Um, honestly, I wouldn't really recommend it. Like, for running-wise, like, I wouldn't recommend it unless you're in lower region somehow. Oh, he's just gonna kill me. Yep, he did. But, like, I wouldn't personally run it. Um, I just ran it. Okay, what the? Why, why did I spawn here? That was so stupid of me. Um, but personally, I wouldn't run it. It can do a little bit of damage. Like, in the right spot. Like, Carrier would have been a good map if I could get in the middle. But I didn't get that map, unfortunately. I'm going to get killed. What was I thinking? Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking there. Okay. This build isn't going to do well against the, the Arthur. I mean, I think I can lock this guy, so that's good. Oh wait, he is locked, all right. Try and heal this behemoth. I am slowly healing this guy up. We need another beacon. I'm gonna go for center. I'm gonna be a risky biscuit. I'm currently suppressed. Oh! I couldn't get the healing. Alright, I guess center didn't really work. Oh, this guy's got shotgun. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna win. I thought we were in the beginning just because of beacon bar, but Whoa if my team gets a beacon then we might win. This guy's got a pretty strong fender. Although he's about to go down. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna win. I probably didn't do too good myself.
the tree right now. This blitz of my on my team, he got four shredders, but I don't think he's gonna survive much longer. Nope. This guy's a beast with this Aljun. And that's game. So we lost that one as well. Unfortunately. Third. Two million damage. Five kills. Three beacons. Honestly, I was expecting worse. <laughs> um, So yeah. That is the kid with Cinder and Star or Triple Stove. I wouldn't really recommend running it. I mean, if you're in lower, lower leagues and you like say you just got your Titan and somehow you get these weapons, yeah, you can run it. It's a fun build to run, nonetheless. Um, if you get it in, like, the good... Sp like, if you get a good map, like, Moon, or Senjin, or, like, potentially Dreadnought. I'm trying to think of other ones, like, Carrier. Carrier is really good. I remember playing um, a game on Carrier, like, pretty much at night when I was playing. <laughs> but I remember playing one where I got into, like, the middle like the center area but it was on the side so I was like down in the crevices or whatever and I was just burning everyone up with the cinders in the stove and I actually ended up taking out a luchador so that kind of surprised me uh but yeah so tell me what you think about this build in the comment section down below yeah it works but I wouldn't really recommend running it and yeah if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe click the bell notification for more and I'll see you in the next one adios